What up, folks? Cajun Blaze here. Man, I just want to wish everyone a very happy new year. 2018 was a fantastic year for us. Started off with my son graduating from boot camp as a Marine in Paris Island. We went down there and uh, visited with him and got to see the Atlantic Ocean for the first time. That was fantastic. We had a good time. As soon as I came home, uh, it was in January, January 17th. We had a little uh, ice down here in South Louisiana and I broke my leg, broke my leg. It was terrible. Man, first bone ever breaking my body in 46 years. Well, I was 45 at the time, but uh, not good, not good at all. So I had to recover from that. Doctor uh, made my leg great again, put some uh, hardware in there and of course, Got an infection in the uh, in the uh, wound. Had to take the hardware out in April. Broke my leg in January. Had to take the hardware out in April. And uh, it was probably a month later in May. I was able to finally go back to work. So that's how the year started. And then we went through summertime. Um, my son surprise came down for Easter. Gave my wife and I a little surprise visit from North Carolina. Uh, that was. So my wife was shopping in the mall and he and my, uh, my son and my daughter uh, snuck up on my wife while she was shopping at one of those stores. It may have been Macy's or Dillard's, I don't know which one, but uh, they were videoing and uh, went up to her and he, he, he went up behind her and said, excuse me, are you my mom? And she jumped, turned around, jumped, oh my God, you know, and it's just a great little video. And then, uh, then I was working till five that day, come home from work and uh, when I got home, I was supposed to be cooking ribs for my nephew and his girlfriend and my daughter. And lo and behold, I come outside fixing to fire up the pit and my, uh, my first son, my Marine, come walking around the side of the house, shocked the hell out of me. Like, where did he come from? And, uh, and then my uh, oldest son that's in the army, he was also down from Florida. And uh, so they both surprised. I had all three of my kids for Easter. My wife and I were thrilled, excited, and overjoyed. Even brought some tears to my eyes. I'm just sentimental like that. Um, so we went through the summer, had a good summer. It was hot. South Louisiana is always hot, 100 plus degrees. Maybe high 90s, but it feels like it with the humidity. And uh, we went through summer fine. Um, September, we took a little vacation down to Pensacola, Florida. Uh, weathered a little tropical storm. We were up on, I don't know, at the Beach Club Resort uh, down there in Pensacola. I forgot exactly what floor we were on, but we had a bunch of family members. My mother-in-law came, uh, my wife's family joined us and uh, had a fantastic time visiting with family on our uh, little vacation. And the year uh, came, came to an end this year and I went through Christmas and I uh, was able to have my uh, son, my, my youngest son, the Marine, come down for Christmas. My oldest son, Caleb, he uh, also came down uh, from Florida. They both had leave and uh, had all three of my kids with me again for Christmas. So what more could you ask for than to have family with you for Christmas? Um, wishing everybody out there in the world love, peace, and joy. I hope y'all had a fantastic year. If you didn't, hey, tomorrow is a new day. It's going to be a new year, 2019. My goal is to be a better person, live a healthier life, hopefully lose some of this weight. I'm fat as fat can be, 330 pounds. So I uh, need to get off my butt and start moving more. Move more, eat less. That's my motto for this coming year. Uh, not really going to go on a diet, going to try to do a lifestyle change. Roller coasters, done them years and years before. Uh, but you know what? It's a new year, a new start, so let's do it again. Hopefully we'll make some change and I have positive uh, thoughts that the change is coming and uh, I don't want to be fat, but when you bend over to put on shoes and socks and tie your laces up and you get out of breath, that's just a shame. That's a crying shame. Something should be done. And uh, eat less, move more, move a lot more, get off my ass, move around. So anyway, I want to wish everyone a happy new year. Right now I'm going to sit here and enjoy this Florida Gerard. This is from Piper's Haven. 
at their new location on Congress Street. Man, they got a fantastic location out there. You can only get this cigar from Piper's Haven in Lafayette on Congress Street. You can Google them, get the phone number, address, give them a call, ask for Renee or Chief, and they'll be happy to help you. Shipping on a little Elijah Craig, small batch. Before the sun goes down, some good stuff here. Oh man. Oh, that's so smooth, so nice. It doesn't, it doesn't hit you like a ton of bricks. So if you haven't had this Kentucky bourbon, highly recommend it. Goes great with a little cigar, a little uh, neat bourbon. Celebrate the new year coming. You guys have a great day. Cajun Blaze always says, not A, not B, but see ya in the next video, that is. Y'all take care.